Hi, I'm Tom Mullaney. I'm coming to you today from the Adobe Express Beta in June 2023, and I am editing a graphic. And I just want to talk to you real quick about text options. They are so much better uh, now in this beta than the previous version of Express. The first thing, first and foremost, if I type, I can type on the graphic as opposed to off to the side as you were forced to do. Now you can type right in the graphic and see the changes in the graphic as they happen. Love that. Now I'm going to go over just a handful of things here. Let me select this text. And there is a dynamic button. This typically works a lot better if you have longer paragraphs and you want to highlight one or two words. Um, additionally, we have the ability to bold, uh, bold and italicize and underline. There's alignment and um, bullets, bulleting really nice. And also the spacing, the letter and line spacing. I'll just do a little letter spacing. Look at that. How about that? Really, really nice. Uh, nice stuff there. Additionally, you're going to have your fill where you have your color that you can play with and you know change it to whatever color you care care to change it to. And then even opacity, you have the ability to change the opacity right there. Two effects that I'm going to get into. Now, this one is already set to be a shape. So we'll do that one first. And it, when we click on um, the shape toggle here, the first thing I want to show you is cut out text. Cut out text is very popular. I know I've used it myself. And if you click on that and there it, as you can see, it cuts out. And so it's just blank. It's just a blue here. And then the green of the leaves behind me, I really like cut out text. I like putting it on top of uh, images. Sometimes it can be really, really nice to do. And again, you just go into shape and then go to that toggle and there you can cut out text or not. And the shapes are nice and we can play with the shapes. I really love and appreciate the shapes with the text. That is really, really nice stuff. But obviously, you know, you can play around with it, change it up however you want to do uh, with shapes. Let's talk about uh, drop shadows. So drop shadows, the other effect I want to get into today. I love that there's these prefab ones that you can play with. And here, I'll just change the color. Maybe go to white for a second. And uh, wow, that is pretty strong and hazy. Let's see. Oh, I like that. Um, but there's a custom ability here where you can play with your blur and your angle and all sorts of good stuff there, as you can see. So that is just a little preview of how text works in the Adobe Express beta. I'm a fan. I'm loving what I can do with this uh, so far. If you have any questions about this, please comment below or tweet me at Tom E. Mullaney. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.